Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. Now charts are independent objects that contain many smaller objects that have their own properties and can be independently formatted to suit your needs. You can also select or embed chart controls within a report, make sure that the chart is selected, and then go to view from the menu bar and select properties to view the properties of the chart control itself. On the data tab, if you click the, into the row source property, you can actually see the SQL statement of the query upon which the data is drawn for the chart. Also, if you need to edit that information, you may click the little Expression Builder button, which appears at the right end of the text box, to view the SQL statement in the Visual Design view, which you can edit if needed, and then close. You can also edit the charts to change their appearance and layout. So to edit the chart objects, double-click the chart object when the report with wi within which the chart is embedded is opened in design view. And this activates the Microsoft Graph program. Note the toolbars change to reflect that fact. The new toolbar which appears allows you to edit the chart object's formatting. You can select any object in the chart and click the available buttons in the new toolbar to format it to your taste. Also, we can do things such as turn the data sheet on and off, or we can also view selected chart object properties by clicking the Properties button that's also displayed in the new chart toolbar. And this gives us some of the options such as the line or border option, the option to change color, or to add data labels such as the value or the percentage of the amount shown. Remember, if you need to add in additional sections so you can format them, they have to be added as dummy data into the data sheet. So you can bring that up if needed using the chart toolbar and give yourself additional sections by just entering in some more fake data, which then at least you'll be able to select and format as needed. And when you're done, click into the actual chart report to deselect the chart, and then you may preview it by just clicking the preview button at the left end of the report toolbar. And that's it to editing your charts and the objects inside the charts. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.